they have a lot of ways to play the game with a Zoe in the mid lane with this Camille up top. They're like, there's a lot of power on that top side of the back. It, it feels like for Weibo, he's like chipping away at Breed's help power. Can he, you know, work with Angel when Angel gets a uh, CC chain? Oh no, Austin Trouble oh. does not have the flash available. Got CC'd, so he can't jump onto the shoulder of one Fung. Oh, it's not what you want to see if you're a Weibo fan, that's for sure. I was thinking that, like, you know, one Fung was the engagement. And a frog. Very nicely done here. <laughs> and a frog comes out as well. Chris actually could be rooted up here. Angel trying to make the play. As SOFM has arrived, this is going to be a smite fight. Way, way forced out of this one. Doggo exhausted. Angel trying to finish this kill off. There it is. A kill going the way of Angel. A jungle vision into Weibo's side of the jungle. Not contesting any of the objectives, but just making sure they can oh. spot over people. Whoa, the damage on to Dom. What is that? I am completely speechless. So, I can't believe how much damage Wong Fong just did. And Doggo desperate to get some plates, desperate to get absolutely anything after what just happened uh, previously. Wong Fong trying to defend as the Herald will be dropped. SOFM is here to answer though. Chris the target. The eye is popped. This will be a couple more plates and a W to finish it off. Lost chapter coming out as SOFM. He's going to be caught in the wrong spot right here. But actually, he pushes Chris out to safety and jumps away on top of him. Weiwei goes down as well. That was gorgeous. SOFM, take a bow, sir, because that was magnificent. Using Chris as his way out is on. Embarrasses himself with a prowling projectile, but it just doesn't matter. Five to one for Weiwei. I mean... You don't want now, he's just dodging all the damage on top side, so. Oh, Shai's in all kinds of trouble. I mean, what can you do? Camille ults you, Leona walks in. There is no outplaying that level of CC, uh, the Shai, unfortunately. And this is where the BLG comp starts to become really aggressive, right? All of these skill shots are going to be flying towards Weibo. And On is going to have to put a lot of work in to try and sustain these health bars. Big damage coming out as Angel goes in onto Doggo, but. Satra tried to use Lost Chapter used as well as Fofo. His Banshees will be on cooldown here. SOFM charging forward. Bit of Honey Fruit to keep himself alive here. Way, way in position. Drake now on the map as Fofo looks for a bubble, but it goes slightly wide. And SOFM has a window to get into this fray. The rest of the team following up as well. SOFM low on HP, using the Crescent Gun to keep himself alive, but Wong Fong is down, as is the Shy. No, over the wall. Keep himself alive, at least for the time being. But BLG, one pick is all they needed. The dragon is there. And that's exactly what we were talking about for BLG. Don't start the dragon. Deny entrance to river for Weibo. Don't give him the chance of a steal. And continuously poke, continuously prod. And yes, you've got a Yumi there. That can heal up a little bit for SOFM. But it's not going to be able to heal up everybody on Weibo's side. And that's where you can see Weibo get pushed out. Dragon goes their way. And Weibo not actually trading that for Baron position means they can do the same again. But Doggo! Oh, ah, Angel! That was gorgeous. Positioning onto the satchel charge to follow him. Gets a bounty off that. That was a 250 gold bounty to aim. Setting up for that pick from Doggo. But Weibo, oh, they've actually wait. just turned towards Baron. TP has to come They just lost it. 2k on the Baron already. It's going to be a 50 50 and it's taken by Weiwei. BLG on the scene. Can they win the fight though? Because right now it's Weibo that are dominating. Double kill comes through for Wong Fong. Bofo survives, but they have access to this. Scary. This is real scary for Weibo. SOFM has to be brave to step forwards on this one. He's got a Yumi on his shoulder. And Weibo needs to get creative. How are they going to find their way into the river? It did not work last time. SOFM charging forwards. It's going to be Paddle Star goes wide as Angel finds a route onto Bofo. Maybe something that can be followed up on. Solar Flare, the bomb's <laughs> coming over. Angel survives for the time being. Has now lost chapter across the team here. And straight on towards the tank on the front line. Breathe turns golden though, and it's one for zero. The junglers are down. Crescendum! Will not do enough damage for the time being. Fofo backing away once again. But Weibo, despite losing their jungler, are still confident to walk into this river. The Shy tanking up, trying to protect Huanfong. But they surely have to just retreat. Yeah, that, that tune was going to change very quickly from Weibo as soon as they saw Breeze coming back in. Just TP's in, and now second dragon going the way of BLG. And it's the, it's the same as every time, right? Denying access to the actual pit. And BLG should be able to get it. I, I, SOFM just got blown up at the start of that fight. And yeah. I'm like, when on earth do you get an opportunity to actually auto attack anyone? And that's some damage from both, bro. That's definitely some damage that he just I, did. 
And it's the reason I'm surprised to see oh. Ephelio's priority over Jinx, because you don't have to problem with Jinx's no. SFM. That was so greedy. He got hit by the bubble and walked forwards anyway, but they're trying to set up, I guess, for one fun. Big damage both ways here. Angel survives. I don't know what went through SFM's head there. I don't know if you just see the bubble, but that's just Baron on a silver platter for BLG. I mean, things have been a little bit messy for SOFM when it comes to engages, both in this series and their last series. Uh, not really respecting whether his team can kind of follow up and support him on those plays. You can see there, right? Like, he has GA. He thinks, hell, look, if I'm going to get my GA pop, like, start the, the party weird. The way that BLG are trying to set up these uh, farm. So I'm put by another bubble here. This time, Weibo has control of River. 20 seconds before the Drake comes up. This is the opposite of what we've seen all game long. The Shy and Breathe and a 1v1. And the Shy ain't winning it. Breathe over the wall. Flashes forward. Can't finish the kill, though. Moonlight Vigil across. This one Fong has to carry here. But it's a kill on to on as the fight starts off. One Fong trying to survive. Has two good guns here. Has the red, has the white. But they can't finish things off for now. Angel backing away as well. And BLG stands strong the 1v1 from breathe paying dividends and now blg reclaim control of the bottom side of the map this will be their third break and it's perfect for blg i mean we thought the Weibo might have been able to get that soul would have been i don't envy it. i feel like sofm is probably getting flamed in twitch chat this game but realistically you have to be the one to face check that's just how it is lost chapter onto bofo here he's gonna have to go back to the portal but he survives he's still more than half of his hp and angel's the one in trouble now he's gone too deep flashes over the wall will survive at least with his life here but the rest of the team now getting on top of the shy he's the target on jumping on try and heal him get that sustain going and suddenly it's breathe being chased down has the ga to work with but will be knocked into that stasis form a couple more shots and he will go down breathe Falls, huge pick for Weibo, and maybe an opportunity to get back on the map. I really don't understand why BLG keep feeling the need to group up, right? Like, keep pushing the waves with Bofo and Duggo. Use Breathe in the side lane. He's decimating the shy there, but now Weibo are in control. BLG have got to see this turf because Weibo are behind them. Oh, that's going to be a bounty as well as they found Doggo in the wrong spot. Another kill. Weibo. There's snow. So you have red and white weapons. Maybe that's the angle. Force BLG into a fight before it's the bomb so comes quick. on. It's already halfway gone. They're just annihilating this Baron. It's surely going to be taken. The bomb comes through. It is going to be taken. The shy, the one to grab it. But Angel goes down for his trouble. SOFM on the front line is way, way trying to get on in. They have to protect one bomb. Down to half HP as Breed goes in. Looks to finish the AD carry. The stopwatch will buy a tiny bit of time, but it's not enough. And BLG get three. And now they can just look to take that wave in mid. The TP's already coming through the shy. The masked man standing. Can he get Doggo? How is Doggo on this side of the tower? Oh my what god. What happened for Doggo to be there? <laughs> He's so I, far I, from <laughs> home. He's not, he doesn't even have a color. Nobody He's knows who he belongs to. <laughs> Oh my days. Well, the tower still go down. We've still got death timers. BLG trying to end the game regardless. I don't know what happened to Doggo. I have no idea, but it's the shy and on against the world. 2v4, but they've got the champions to do it. Breathe jumping on forward. The shy flashes away. Damage coming out. Is this? They're running out of minions here. The shy just has to clear the minion wave, but one tower has gone down. BLG is just going to end the game. They're brute forcing this one. The Nexus will fall, and BLG take their first series. I'm BLG.